C'est bien tout ce, que, tout ce que je devais faire. Je crois, oui. À part, bien sûr, un peu vieux. Countryside, you can see the view, it's really nice. So, we put on this antenna and we will uh, to do some test, tests with the radio. Thank you, 73. HB3, YG au portable, à l'écoute du relais. testing these radios and now we will talk about the topic of the day and the question is is my husband a mechanics or does he have any background in mechanics and the answer is no we often have this question because he does uh, do a lot of work on the defender but he doesn't have any background background in mechanics um, he does uh, research a lot when he needs to do any maintenance or repairs on the Defender or install any gear or accessories and I want to share with you where does he find all the information to be sure that he does the job correctly. So the first place is of course the workshop manual. You will find a lot of information in your workshop manual and it should be the first place that you should look at if you want to do any maintenance uh, on your Defender. So that's the first place, the workshop manual. Now uh, for more information on some kinds of repair or more specific maintenance operation on a specific Defender, he will also go on two forums. Uh, one will be in French and the name is Land Rover FAQ, F-A-Q, and the other one is an English one and it would be it is, sorry, it is Defender2Net. So I will put uh, the links in the des description below like this. You can also have a look. And uh, now the other place uh, where he gets the information when he needs some help uh, when working on the Defender is uh, on social media. And it will be either on Facebook groups, Land Rover groups, uh, as there's many people in, the, in these groups. Uh, some of you are very skilled and have a, a lot of knowledge in the, your defenders, so uh, it's very nice of you to share what you know like this. We can also uh, get some more skills and also either repair a defender or do the maintenance properly. And uh, on top of Facebook, he is also in some WhatsApp group WhatsApp <laughs> Land Rover groups so he can also have some help in these WhatsApp groups and uh, the last place 
the last place, sorry, where he can find uh, very good information. But of course, you will have to find the proper information. And maybe on internet, sometimes it's a little bit complicated, but a very good place to look when you are looking for accessories or gear that you would like to install on your Defender or on any four wheel or scamper, it would be, of course, YouTube. Yeah, on YouTube, like us. So uh, he does, we, because I also do look at those channels, we uh, look more on the Australian uh, channels when we are looking for gears and accessories uh, that are more uh, related to the to the camper, uh, Defender camper. If we are looking for some accessories for overlanding, Australian do ha do, do have very good products, and they also are very good because they are tested in harsh uh, conditions. So we know we do know that they are reliable, and they do have great setups. So it gives good good ideas. Uh, on what we and also what you can do on your Defender camper. Uh, the, the only problem with uh, the Australian channels is that, or the Australian brands, is that there's nothing really uh, specifically done for the Defenders. Maybe I can say that Nugget stuff is, of course, uh, for Defenders and he does very good products, but most of the brands in Australia are more into maybe Japanese uh, four-wheelers. So if you are looking for stuff that, are, that is specific for a Defender, maybe you should better look at the UK uh, stores or websites uh, to find some accessories or gear. Now, if it's more on uh, for mechanics, Defender mechanics, uh, he does uh, look more on the UK channels, yeah, th as they are really um, skilled in the mechanic, of course, Land Rover is from the UK, so maybe, I mean, this is, um, this is obvious that it's best to look at uh, UK channels if you, are, if you are looking to repair or do a maintenance on your Defender. So those are the places uh, where he looks when he has to do some work on the Defender. And of course, uh, to, to acquire more skills, the only thing to do is to get under your Defender, in it, on top of it, where, wherever you have to go to install uh, anything, any gear, any accessory, or if you have to do some mechanics on it, you do have to start somewhere. He didn't have any skills in the beginning. He did acquire a lot of skills during uh, the, these 11 years that we have this Defender now. So this is also why we decided to start this channel, is to share with you guys uh, some D DIY uh, easy maintenances that you are able to do by yourself at home and without uh, bringing your car to the garage. So that's uh, where he acquired all his skills. He does um, continue asking for help on Facebook, Facebook groups, on WhatsApp, does a lot of research on the forums, on YouTube. So this is a never-ending um, education <laughs> there so of course also he did spend I don't know how many hours but hours and hours outside uh, working on the Defender so I'm sure that if you are a Defender owner you do also have all these hours behind you on or inside that Defender so that was the topic of the day. Uh, you saw before that we did go and try um, to do some uh, quick radio communication and we did. We were able to have someone that was in, uh, who was in Spain. Yeah, so the one that you saw, that you heard before uh, was in Spain. So it was, um, yeah, it was nice, it was fun. 
So I hope you enjoyed this topic and tomorrow we will talk about another one. Don't know which one yet, but I hope you'll enjoy. Please let me know where you find all the information when you want to do a maintenance, a repair, or if you want to install any kind of accessories or gear under your defender. If you go on the same forums or if there's any other place that you find the info, you, we would love to know it also. So I'll talk to you, I'll talk to you tomorrow. I hope you had a great day in this difficult time with this coronavirus and that your family is also safe. So I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.